he did that, I'm not, I'm not actually surprised. Okay. My soul is up in 600 damage nuke! No thank you! No. Yeah, it was something like that. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, just makes the value point better, I guess. Right? Wallach? We going on to him now? Stuff about fatal bonds that is... Eh. Slightly more annoying to deal with, but it doesn't yeah. actually change anything. Um, Wind Ranger power shot. Holy crap. Yeah, she got buffed yeah, so hard. Sniperino. Yeah. Max damage is now done. Okay. That's a nerf. Yeah, that's a nerf. It, it's more of a bug fix than a nerf, because before, uh, it, it, you just channel it for 0.7 no, no, seconds. No, 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 It's still the same timing, because... Oh, yeah, because uh, they improved ca cast, cast point. point. Oh, yeah. Oh, I didn't even consider that. Yeah, makes sense, then. Alright, reduce area of the lingering vision at the end. And the, uh, indirect buff with the, uh, attack speed. Yep. So, yeah, just... Yeah. And then I got a bunch of buffs to power shot, which is good because that courier. was it used to be her worst ability. Okay, courier. I think I just. No, no, no. You, no, not if you if you're playing like most people will actually oh, skip power no, shot I completely. I think, whoa, no, no. I think you would max power. The way she gets played at like six k, uh, <laughs> and in pro tier was people would do, run her mid and then skip power shot and go for a win run and shackle shot specifically shackle shot max. <clears throat> But I think, uh, like, off lane, you play, like, ooh, max power shot, one, one run run, and then, and then you max Q. Yeah. And then, like, you rarely get, you don't, you don't get your ult until, like, really late. Yeah. Okay. Korea? Okay, like, um, nice. that, I guess that just gives me one extra iron branch. I don't really see what, oh, well, yeah. okay, let's see. It's you, just how nice much do you get? 475, supports. right? So you could, hold on. 625. 625? Yeah. Okay. Um, minus 120. Buff. Minus 150. Minus 100. Or wait, how much are tangles? 135? Something like that. 125? <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure it's 125. Hold on. And then self actually got changed to be 115, so we should include that. Tango is 125. Yeah. And then, oh, it is. So you could actually build. You could actually have one support by all of the items now, and they'd be yeah. in lane. Yeah. I'm predicting that we see some four core drops. Hmm. Yeah, maybe. I, I I think that we see more smokes early game. Oh yeah, that too. All right. And, oh. and uh, the. Other support will go for more offensive, I like more offensive points early, yeah. or more offensive items early, I guess. Okay, omelet of mod Digian, recipe cost reduced. It's really not that significant. On, just get it faster. No, 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 no. They keep on buffing armlet. They keep on buffing the chaos knight. They played chaos knight. Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah. Alright, Blink Dagger is no longer disabled if you take no damage. This this makes sense. Blink Dagger doesn't need more buffs, but this actually makes sense, so I'm okay with it. Yep. Courier carrying a non full bottle will is. Oh, yes, bottle. no more bottle pro crow. Death to bottle crow, man. Sure. Well, Strong yeah. bottle crow. You actually, like, it's actually impossible to bottle crow now, but they make up for it for, by the fact that last patch there were, you can get two runes. So, yeah. No more bottle crow. I'm gonna get boxes too. Oh. Alright, broadsword. Replace tel Like, this doesn't need. This actually. That's actually pretty good. Yeah, it means you can finish blade mail at side shop. Huge buff to LC. That's a buff. It, it, it also means you can get your components for other items no, faster too. Cares. So, like. Let's see, was it, does it build battle into Battle Fury? Fury? Yeah. yeah builds so into Battle Fury, a... builds into yeah. blade mail. Mm -hmm. Yep. Circlet. Oh, we could buy full blade mail at that job. I didn't yeah, remember. yeah. That, that's what I said. I said buff to LC and clockwork uh, as well. It, so okay, not so much clockwork. Like more LC if you're still because I've had games where I get like a super fast buff blink to and blade blood mail. Seeker, man. What are you talking about? Oh my god. <laughs> Bloodseeker doesn't play the lanes though. 
Yeah, once they were actually, I, I should send you that jungle guide from the other day, because it is ridiculous. It's like 6 minute phase, full man's shield, level 6. Okay. Jungling, yeah. Clarity, um, that's fine. So it really only supports we're getting it, and they were yeah. getting starved with VXP anyways, so it's actually pretty nice. Yep, Crimson God. You get that value, 15 mana. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, these circuit and parody, but, uh... Alright. I don't know what the Crimson Guard does. Uh, it basically is like a it's like a damage absorbing shield that uh, oh, absorbs okay. fifty damage. Mm. It makes blade. It, it uh makes what is it? Vanguard better because Vanguard was useless item, but now it builds into Crimson Guard, so it's not actually a useless item. It's uh, but Crimson Guard is good at, good against uh, uh, illusion heroes only, really. Okay. Uh, uh, Defuse wings. Yeah. Defuse blade. Oh yeah, now this is awesome, I want to talk about this. Okay, so like, the heroes who build Diffuser Blade, like, uh, um, PL and sometimes also, um, Spectre will build it, and I guess also, Naga. yeah, Ricky and Naga. So for Ricky it's amazing because you can get lifesteal, and also Scotty. For PL it's amazing, you can get lifesteal and also Scotty, and for... Um, Naga. Naga is yeah. amazing because you can get life still in Scotty. And would you get Scotty on Naga? Oh, I guess. No, I think you get rather get Scotty on Naga because you don't. Yeah, it gives you life better still. stats. Like no, you, life no, still stacks with Scotty. Yeah, life still in Scotty. Oh, it does. Stack. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, it basically everyone now can get Scotty and life still as well if they want to build a Fusil Blade. So that's super legit. It's too super good. Super legit. That might almost, I mean, almost be too good. It's no. mainly good on the illusion heroes though, because they benefit so much from being able like not so much from the lifesteal, but being able to have a Scotty on an illusion hero, like that is insane. Yeah. Okay, uh Drum of Endurance. The, the one shame there is that uh it won't stack with anti mage's Q, so you can't do some silly anti mage defusal blade. Mm -hmm. Kill it like against a storm. Drop the storm down to zero mana super quickly and then ult him. What they could do is they could make an anti mages thing also not a unique attack modifier. Yeah, I think that would be a nest. Like I think that's a necessary buff to anti mage. What are you talking about? If they're doing it, anti mage does not need to be buffed. If they're doing it to defusal blade, why not anti mage? But that's just my opinion, I guess. Okay. Draw of endurance, endurance charges increased. Okay, so basically they realize that people don't rebuy the recipe anyway, so we might as well just increase charges. Mhm. Mm I still also, think it should make it reloadable for like a fraction of the price, but I don't know. It is or, or maybe just the recipe, have... just the recipe, like Dagon. Hmm. You don't have to buy the 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 full drum. You just rebuy the recipe. Yeah, because you don't have to buy the bracer or the the robe of magi. Yeah. Okay. Your scepter of divinity, more cost, which is good, I think. Yeah, I, that, that's the items in Chandy cheap. Yep. Like you, you might think like hundred gold, but like think about the times when uh when you were playing uh blink heroes and like like oh my playing hundred gold well, J K it's your hundred because <laughs> yeah got, yeah that's so annoying cost increase yep okay so healing salve cost reduced okay so I was wrong I thought it was one twenty five to one fifteen but no it's one fifteen to one ten four four uh, it it doesn't really change much it, yeah. No, four horrors, come on. Uh, Five gold. Hel okay, Helm of the Dominator. Whoa. Yeah, this is insane. Straight up just doubling it. It's not even insane. Yeah, I guess not. It, it helps with ancient stacking. I mean, people that's really all that Helm of the Dominators get used for. People don't use the creeps for their actual like creep stuff. They just use it to ancient stack. Which is good. It was normally after you stack the ancients like three or four times, the creep will die. Um, no, 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 you can just, you can just send it back to Fountain during the downtime that's not stacking. Nah, it's just less micro-intensive though. I like it though. I, it, it makes, it makes, uh, I think it makes it more viable to just use the creep for actual creep purposes. Yeah. Okay. Wait, has Ken ever bought a Helm of the Denominator? Okay, okay. Uh, yes. Also, you can buy, like, 28 Helm of the Dominators and dominate 28 Creeps. They don't even have to be in your inventory, they can be dropped in your fountain. Sick. It's, it's pretty awesome. interesting. Why isn't that a thing? Like, of Probably contact, because you're spending, like, 1,700 gold to get a shitty Creep. Okay, how about you, like, 
invest all your gold in your team for Hound Dominator and then you just instead of Mass Sniper Pro. I, I told you when we tried to do the Midas on TB strat at the start of the game last time, I was like, guys, it doesn't work anymore. What doesn't work anymore? The, uh, the, at the start of the game, buy Sentry Wards for your carry with all of the gold, and then he gets an instant blink dagger or something. Yeah. Okay, magic wand. Magic wand's now a better counter to Bristleback. <laughs> magic wand now has 17, or, or alternatively, magic wand now has 17 char charges, but you'll still forget to use it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, four for teams. Just that is not around. him using a slurpee, that is him taking a shower. Seriously? Yeah, he's in the shower, look at Skype. I'm not going to. He has his shirt up like one of those girly tops, you know, like. I I'm not going to do it because I'm short on stream. Uh, I don't want to put Sunny through that humiliation. Okay, Sunny, Sunny. Yo, if we're gonna do this, you can't be taking a shower right now because it is messing up with the Skype call quality <laughs> okay. way too much. Here's what happened. I came in here to wash my feet and like, oh, this warm water is really nice. And, like, I, and I was like, alright, I'm gonna sit down, and now I'm sitting down in the, the bathtub. Okay, okay, uh, okay. What but the heck am I? Magic Wand, uh, it, it encourages you to uh, upgrade from Stick to Wand now. Oh, yeah! Okay, we still hear the water, though, so, like, you gotta do something about that. Put a silencer on your, um, your shower. Or turn it off. Which okay. sounds like you just did. Okay, Medallion of Courage, Recipe, Host, and Grace. And, uh, but it's it's also a buff because Valor can now be cast on allies and I more armor. That. It's nice. I like it. It's an interesting change. Also, the seven armor. Uh, and there's one oh, armor. That, that perfectly justifies the recipe cost increase. Yep. I think I think armor is a really, really especially early game, which is when people when it, which is when people are going to have medallion of courage. Yeah, I like it. All right, pipe. Of insight, recipe cost reduced because no one buys the item, and barrier duration increased because no one buys the item. P pretty, pretty clear, right? Yeah. Well, mm, sure. And people do buy it, but yeah. Yeah, well, yeah. And refresher, refresher all more nerfs. Uh, that's, uh, that's, no. That's, goodbye, Death Prophet. Goodbye, Tide Hunter. It, it doesn't change too much, actually. Yeah, it doesn't. No, Death Prophet, Tide Hunter. Uh, silencer. Yeah, but no, 10 seconds. Like, that's from. Hold on. Okay. Just, just, just go Shadow Amulet. Hold on, hold on. One do I do? That's a 5.5% duration, or like cooldown. Increase. But it also encourages you to, like, not use your, uh, uh, refresher so sparsingly. Yeah, I agree. Alright, Shadow Amulet. Cost reduced. That means you get Shadow Blade faster because it yeah. doesn't say that Shadow Blade got uh, cost increased. Yeah, so something. So saw, uh, Shadow Blade costs 200 bucks now. Yeah, something I also like is uh, they continually buff Shadow Amulet rather than buffing Shadow Blade. So Shadow Amulet is like actually a really interesting item now. They need to like make Shadow Amulet make into something else. Yeah, uh, I remember there was a leaked like potential item, like an leaked item concept called the Shadow Cloak or something, and it was like, I forget exactly what it did, it like gave you magic resistance or something, it was I weird. Think, I think the rest are just like quality of life changes that we don't yeah, yeah. go into though. Yeah, d alt, cl alt click everything, alt clicking, yeah yeah, in fact if you alt cl click that section it says alt clicking everything. You also alt click the, the, the patch notes. Why am I life stealer? I don't know, dude. This hero's not even good. I guess it's because of the uh, control. It's like life stealer yeah. controlling you. My your... hero's controlling you. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Oh, uh, I like it. United States Army. <laughs> All right. Okay. So th this uh, fixes for several effects being erroneously visible through the fog of war. Uh, basically, that means that no more uh, you scout the level one Roche because you look at you move your camera to the Roche pit and you see nature's profit, nature profit auto attack. I've had I've done that so many times to people. Well, I I like just like I'm like oh, I wonder if they're rushing right now. I look over, I just see a nature's profit auto attack flying through the air. It's like yep, they're rushing. So that's good. Well, they improve service stability. That's awesome. Yeah. 
Hopefully we don't get all dropped, except, like, oh my god, that game still has me salty. We all get dropped, and then the the other team still has players on it, and then no poor network conditions detected, and then we just lose. Oh my god, that was so dumb. Okay, but yeah, so, this, that's the patch. Uh, do we have any heroes that we think are going to get played? Wait, 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 this Sanjanyasha meme, uh, I always thought it was weird, like, what I'm slowed, and like... Oh, oh yeah. And, uh, you look at your you look at your buff bar and like oh the Sanji Nasha. It also has yeah, a little bit of like a blood sticky effect thing, but yeah. That, I that's never good. see that when I'm fucking getting like wrecked by a PA or something. PA building. Oh yeah, gross. Okay. Alright, whatever. So six point eight three. What, what do you think? Who who who's the big winners? Who's the big losers? In uh, what? Supports big winners. Yep. Sure. Co-op also big winner. My heroes also certain big winners. Mid certain mid laners also big big winners. Oh, yeah. So support mid. Uh, losers off laners. Mm -hmm. I'd Tide say. Better. Yeah. Tide yeah. nerf. Stuff Tide that's in the meta. Tide hundred percent nerf. Um. Room tide. Junglers. I I would say junglers winner. I don't know though. Yeah. Well, yeah, because they buffed uh, the two junglers who are really like super viable. And self cost decrease. Oh yeah. And one down there. Like honestly, there weren't too many nerfs this patch. Like there were nerfs, but they don't feel like they're big deals at all. But yeah, I'd say the biggest losers are probably off laners. Yeah. Winner support then mid, because co-op buffs. Yeah. Uh, A few carries. Yeah, I nice guess. As well. Yeah, they aren't. They aren't touching carries because I don't think carries are the problem right now. No, they're, not, they're really not. My carries got buffed though, so that makes me happy. They're, and also, I guess at this point, they're just trying to diversify it a little, but I don't see the need. I don't think. I think the only way to diver like to uh, change what carries are going to be used is to either change the meta or over nerf the ones that are being used currently. Yeah. Also, Winter Wyvern confirmed. Unless... Yeah, yeah. Unless, unless you give, like, Luna a button that can insta-kill the entire enemy team. What, you're talking about two. Eclipse? At level 2. Oh, okay. Give her, like, the reverse lich. Like, honestly, Luna support's not that bad with Eclipse Aghanim Scepter now. Like, you do Blink Aghanim Scepter on Luna. That's 14, like, oh, I, don't, I, sh I, like I should know what the exact Luna damage is. Like yeah, same. If, if we do that dual lane, even though that dual lane works if you send Jow mid and then just have Luna with, like, Avenge in her lane or something. Okay. Oh my god. Please, that's Are you guys, like, robots? Why? No. Uh, he's, he's talking about the... Yeah, okay. So, level 4 Lucent Beam, maximum damage possible to a single target. This is without ags as well, and before reductions, 3,600. And so now that it, that's even more. Alright. That's, that's not true at all. Yeah, it is. Alright, well... Because, uh, ags, ags... You have a limit on how much a single target can be hit. Guys, I got finals to study for. <laughs> okay. Time. Yeah, this went way longer than I expected it was going to go for. Took two and a half hours. So. Yeah. Oh my god. Alright, so yeah. 8.13, I, I guess I have one until like 11 to study, was, but... It was fun though. Nobody turned fun. out to the stream, but whatever. Ah, uh, it's because I'm here. <laughs> no, it's because I didn't... I should have like messaged Note, it's like... But then he... I, I didn't want to message Note, because then he'd be like, Oh, I, I want to join you guys. No, because then he'd be like, Oh, you guys talked about League. I'm, I'm out of here. <laughs> oh yeah, that too. No Omni Knight nerfs, why? Why not? Because they didn't have emergency less fetch. Because they buffed the, uh, well, no. No. No Omni Knight nerfs. I'm sad. Was but, it the oh, yeah. Druid no, buff? It's more viable because, uh, no. not a unique attack modifier, so more people can buy it. Oh, yeah. Oh my god, yes! Sydney is a genius. That's why I had you on, Sydney, because I knew you would look at all this oh. stuff. Yeah, Diffusal Blade. Yeah. Can be bought on who? On anyone who, like, <laughs> Medusa. Can, oh for, God. For those who plan to buy buy a unique attack modifier, we can actually pick up Diffusal now as well. Oh, hold on. 
I gotta say something. You think there's gonna be some, like, big plays with couriers and stuff where you swap a Diffuser Blade? Like, you buy a Diffuser Blade in the early game to deal with Omni, and then late game you swap it onto your hero to deal with Omni? With couriers? That's... wait, wait. wait. Yeah, I get, no, whatever. No one, no one does, like, seven slotted anymore. Yeah. Okay, we should, uh, we should end this. Huh, so... Yep. You, all right, I was about to say, ask if you guys wanted to do any shoutouts, but you know. Shoutouts to, uh... Shoutout to Nick Norte. Shoutout to Maui Gyms, providing the awesome Matrix sunglasses. Um, oh, I don't know. Uh, or just came out, he kind of... Um, Shoutout to TSM, to TSM1. Right, Shoutout to Cloud9, I bought a hoodie from them the other day. Shout also, out to Fnatic. <laughs> also, Eternal Envy did this like big post about what's wrong with the Dota 2 scene, which uh, you guys should read. Shout out to Fnatic, because Fnatic needs some love right now. Yeah, especially their Dota team. <laughs> their league team. Wait, are both of their teams dead? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> they, they only have Counter-Strike now. Don't they have Hearthstone? The, the thing is, they still have a slot in LCS. They got the guaranteed slot because they came in, they like actually placed in the tournament at the end of the season, so they actually need to get a team. Yeah. They okay, also so have a I'm just going to end the stream. Alright, thanks everyone who watched, even though it was like actually no one. People will probably watch the YouTube yeah. though. Yeah, yeah, catch the VODs. Shout out to YouTube. <laughs>